Hi, Bruce and Ann again, and we're getting ready for week six. This is the night before, so Friday night. Six? I thought it was five. Four. Four? Four. Well, we just did four. Huh? Be week five. We didn't just do week four. We get, I got a card for three, and I'm going to go get card four. No, you're going to get card five. What you, happened to card four? You did card four. Which one? That was the bridge to nowhere. Mm, no. Are you trying to trick me here? No. <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> okay, I'm confused. Hmm. <laughs> we got three cards. We're going for number four. You should have four cards. Do I need to go look again? I think you might. Get your cards. She's got four cards. <laughs> three, one, two. I only have three. Three! Well, remember card number four was in the plastic bag at the Bridge Nowhere. Okay, well, I don't know where that is. Nope. At the moment. Okay, so we'll find it. So this is going to be card number five that you get tomorrow. Right? Okay, I guess so. <laughs> okay. And I've lost track. <laughs> lost track. <laughs> We're counting up to five. It's getting big numbers now. <laughs> okay, people, I am not old. <laughs> okay, so uh, card five. I know I started with card six, so I, I'm out of it, too. I'm, I guess I'm rushing it. The... Uh, don't rush it. I'm having fun. You're having fun? I'm glad. <laughs> the whole purpose of this. Make sure you're having fun. Okay, so card five. Um, so last week, Anne guessed the uh, the clue is where uh, Marjorie meets Marguerite. And that was very easily. St. Joseph Hospital. St. Joseph women's. Hospital. St. Joseph's Women's Hospital. St. Joseph Women's Hospital. And... Uh, Again, where Marguerite is our daughter's middle name, uh, named after both my mom, Marjorie, and... Anne's. My mother's name was June, so June is named after right. my mother. And then her grandmother's... Then my mother's mother was Marguerite, with two T's, the French version, mm -hmm. and we, we took that for June. Right. So that, uh, that's what that's about. And like I said, she guessed where. Um, so St. Joseph's Women's Hospital here in Tampa is where both of our children were born, both Adam and June. So um, how can you look back at 25 years and, and not remember where your beautiful children are born, right? So um, that is one of the little landmark places in our lives. Uh, so we're going to just go over there. I don't know if we can even get in the lobby with all of the... COVID I don't think stuff so. going on, but nobody's letting anybody in. But that's okay. You know. Um, we were there a few months ago to see our granddaughter uh, being born in that same hospital. So uh, that, that's even more so special uh, meaning for us. But uh, we're going to go there so that uh, Anne can get her fifth card and, um, and a clue for that. So. That one, I don't think she'll get in seconds. Another hard one. <laughs> Might be. I may be asking you guys to help me. <laughs> Ooh. One of our stops this morning is at the chiropractor. It's Lifeline Chiropractic. Dr. Lisa, absolutely wonderful lady to uh, get your back all in order. So. Not quite like having a, a nice massage, but uh, kind of the next best thing. All right, so here we are having breakfast at Hot Bellies, a quaint little restaurant. It's uh, here in South Tampa, back behind Britain Plaza, one of uh, Adam's good friends, Jordy, who's over there right now at the window works here. It's always fun to have her service. 
So. All right, Jordy brought our breakfast. I have a uh, steak and cheese omelet with hash browns. Dan's got a couple of eggs with sausage and hash browns over there, or actually potatoes. This is a wonderful place. So if anyone gets a chance to come to Pot Bellies here in Tampa, I think you're gonna enjoy it. Okay, so we're over here at St. Joseph's Hospital. And something cool I wanna show you though, hold on. So one of the neat things is, is the address of this place. I, I love numbers and kind of their, their meaning. And it's just, I think, fun that the, uh, the address here is four, three, two, one. It's like having a countdown. But uh, here's the place. Here, it's rather nice, simple little entrance. The even the emergency room entrance here um, does not, you know, seem that like a normal hospital. Which is all rather nice. And I wish we could take you in and show you how beautiful actually it is inside. But uh, with everything going on, we can't. But uh, so here, we're going to let Anne have her other card, so so she doesn't have to find it. This is, now let her take over from here so she can talk to you. This is card number five. Move to card number six. Periodically, you did win this. Periodically, you did win this. Welcome to card number five. This one was easy to get. It took you just seconds. Here we remember where both of our children were born. Such wonderful times. Periodically, you did win this. Okay, I have to think about that. Right. Now, I talked to you before that there's going to be very few people oh, yeah. that you okay. would understand to know this. And I can only think of three people, uh, which would have been Allison, your sister, and Marlene. Okay. Okay? Mm -hmm. And Allison would be very questionable if she would even know this or not. Uh, your sister may not even think about it or at all, so may not be. And it may be something that Marlene goes, oh, yeah, you know, way back in the back recesses of her head. But um, Okay, so we'll have to think on this. You have to think on this. All right. Any, any ideas yet? No, not right no. now. No? No. Okay. So we'll just sit here and, and, and reminisce for a minute. Uh, I said, on the outside, it just looks like an apartment complex almost, but uh, inside it was just quite nice. Anyway, short video today. Thank you for being here with us, and if anybody has any ideas, and it was periodically, you did win this. So, uh, a little bit different. All right, guys, we'll catch you next week. Bye. you